Hello and welcome to a little short clip on this cow and her stone. This cow was purely in for routine trimming. There was no signs of lameness whatsoever, um, especially on the front feet. The back feet weren't walking fantastic, but she definitely wasn't lame. Um, so you'll imagine my surprise when I found this in her food. What have we here? So I was just trimming this cow routinely, not looking for anything. I wasn't filming, because I didn't think it was anything special. Well, it's not special, it's not nice. Look at the size of that stone in there. It's either a stone or a tooth, I'm not sure. Could be a tooth actually. Either way, it looks bloody sore. Let's get the sucker out. Is well stuck in there. That's a wrap. As you can see, she walks out of the crush completely fine. She's a little sort of shaken from having her feet up, but you can see she's definitely not lame and she's still not lame on that front left foot. It paired out really, really well. Uh, the horn was really nice and sound and she's not gonna have any after effects from having that stone in there or from having it removed. So I have no idea if there was a crack there first or whether this was a sharp stone that managed to penetrate into a white line and stick there. The white line on a cow's foot is the sort of weak link in the chain if you like. So if something's gonna penetrate, if it hits the white line, then it does stand a chance of getting in there. But more often than not, the crack comes first and then the stone invades that crack. As you can see, this is a fairly large stone. When you think about how big a stone needs to be inside your shoe to be extremely painful, this cow, to show no signs of lameness whatsoever, is pretty impressive. Let me know what you think, and as always, click that subscribe button and ring that little bell. Cheers guys, bye now.